Ukrainian forces around Kharkiv, in northeastern Ukraine, appear to have pushed Russian troops from the east past Turnover, a settlement on the Russian border. If confirmed, the Ukrainians' liberation of Turnover could mark an inflection point in Russia's 10-week-old wider war in Ukraine. In late March, Ukrainian forces drove Russian invaders from northern part of the country. Now it appears that they are driving the invaders from the east too. We're hoping that this momentum accelerates and Russia is forced into a messy withdrawal. Russia failed to encircle the Ukrainians in the east. Instead they are finding themselves increasingly encircled and more trouble with supply routes. Artillery is now 6 kilometers away from the Russian border. It must be so tempting for the Ukrainians to attack. Just imagine if your family came from Bucha and you see a Russian city in your sights. If Ukraine gets Russia out of their country, they need to be made a member of NATO. That would allow them to develop their natural gas reserves safely without the threat of Russian invasion. Turkey has also discovered massive gas reserves in the Black Sea. If both of those countries can become the main exporters of gas to Europe then that will be the death of the Russian economy. If indeed the Ukrainian forces around Kharkiv, including the battle-hardened 92nd and 93rd mechanized brigades, have pushed all the way to the Russian border, they not only can prevent Russian artillery from targeting Kharkiv, they could fire their own guns at Russian areas on the far side of the border. This crisis has reached a turning point, and the clear victory for the Ukrainians is very near.